Hi guys, this is another traffic training with Fabian. Good evening, thank you so much for being here. For those who don't know me, my name is Fabian Cordova. I'm just gonna be teaching you today something extremely important. We have been talking about this past couple of trainings from how do you start from Facebook to how do you have to actually understand the true metrics that you're gonna be implementing within your business. And now I'm gonna break down the most important part. How are you gonna start segmenting your traffic so you can really optimize on the true most important values, which are your customers. Just wanna make like a quick intro. Uh, for those who are starting and those who are just basically learning, or even if you haven't heard this before, the most important part, how you can profit from your business is to make the most that you can from every single dollar that you paid in advertisement. If it's on Facebook, if, if it's on Instagram, if it's on Google, if it's in any other platform, the most important part is that you guys need to segment your traffic in order to take advantage of the different steps of your prospecting, okay? So I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna start making a simple example and, and I'm gonna go in depth on those specific, uh, let's say, steps that I learned and implemented immediately and literally changed my game. Okay, so let me go to the whiteboard real quick. Uh, so again, you're gonna be segmenting your traffic. Okay, so let's start with the traffic, right? So traffic can come from any traffic source. This can be Google, Facebook, YouTube, uh, Instagram, uh, Tabula, anything. But the most important part is that you guys have to understand that this is a funnel. So this is gonna be going here and this is going to be here. So this is all the traffic that you're gonna be sending. So this is gonna be the money that you're gonna be spending and this is where you guys want to be making the big bucks, right? So I'm gonna make $5 signs because if you want to invest, you wanna make more. Hopefully, twice as much and even more, okay? So the most important part, and then I'm just gonna change my color because we're going to segment this in different layers, okay? Okay, so the first layer, it's called cold traffic. The second one is called warm traffic. The third one is called hot traffic. And the last one, those are the existing customers. Okay, and now I'm gonna step over this side so I can really break down how do you really need to make this happen, okay? So, again, those are the four steps from your traffic funnel that are gonna be always present, okay? So this is a principle, okay? Principle-based targeting, it's not never gonna change. So, if you're sending people, and this is your website, The idea is to always make money. But generally, what people don't remember is that if you're only focusing, and this is what happens, 90% of people only focus on the cold traffic, which is good, it's good. You still are you know, generating more clients, which is also really good, and it's super important in every single business. It doesn't matter if it's e-commerce, if it's a physical business, if it's uh, a gym, if it's a dentist, it doesn't matter. The same thing applies to the same thing. So, uh, right here, we don't wanna make that specific example because that's the most important thing that I, wanna, I want you guys to, to know that you shouldn't do, okay? The most important thing is that you break this down based on your results. So first things first, principle, what is cold traffic? Okay, in this specific example, let's talk about Facebook. Um, cold traffic will be someone or a prospect that they don't know who you are, they don't even have an idea that you exist. So definitely you will be targeting, uh, let me put it in here, um, interests, behaviors, and demographics, which are the top um, Facebook, uh, let's say, pattern that you will take, of course, which is really good, which means you're always gonna be prospecting people uh, to your first phase, okay? So this is phase one, phase two, phase three, and phase four, okay? So in phase one, cold traffic. What is warm traffic? 
Okay, so warm traffic means people that already know who you are, they probably have liked your page, they probably engage with your post, they probably even save your post, they can even uh, comment it in another, uh, let's say, Instagram post or Facebook post. So we can create definitely custom audiences and if you, don't, if you don't know what a custom audience is, please go back to the other training so you can really understand because this is super important. But let me just make a pause right now to ask you guys, and if you really are finding this information fa uh, valuable, please go to SebastianGomezMentoring.com. We really wanna help you guys. This is just basically simple terms that we implement. If you really wanna learn uh, through us and learn from us, we can definitely help you guys apply this to your business. So again, if you're interested and you're finding this inf information valuable, please go to SebastianGomezMentoring.com. Let's go to the page. If you like what you see, just schedule a call. You're definitely gonna be talking to me. So just take advantage of this opportunity. We're basically recording all these trainings for you guys for free so you can learn and apply. And if you're even more willing to take a risk and really apply this and get more results faster, just go over there and schedule a call okay so let's go back to the other side of the training so again warm it's people that engage with your post and people that have that for example uh, watch a specific if you're using a video uh, have watched a specific uh, let's say percentage of your video it can be 25% it can be 50% it can be 75% it can be 95% or even 100% and something really cool is that you can leverage your Facebook fan page and your Instagram business page to engage through those audiences because they already know who you are. They're more willing to buy from you than someone that they don't have a freaking clue like who you are, right? So again, following through the steps. So hot traffic. So let me just write here. So it's Facebook page, Instagram page, page, and let's say also, uh, any posts that you do to make it simple. Hot traffic, what is hot traffic? Hot traffic is basically anyone that has landed to your website. Okay, so anyone that lands on your website has a higher level of intent than someone that they don't have a clue who you are or someone that just liked or shared or just saved your post. Someone that lands on your site has a higher level of intent that you really have to take advantage of. It's just like, they just need a little push for them to convert and make you profits, which is basically what we want, right? Okay, so depending on the type of website you have, if you have an e-commerce store, if you have a regular website, if you're basically doing a lead generation or you'll be doing a survey, the most important part, again, is that you lev leverage the Facebook pixel. So for those who don't know, I will refer you back again to the, to the pixel training, but those who are really following me right now, this is the most important part because anyone that has landed to, for example, if you're, if, let's make an e-commerce example. Anyone that goes to your site, they actually view your content. If they will wanna go more, they will add to cart if they wanna buy your product. The next step will be initiate checkout or the purchase. So for example, you can retarget people who have viewed your content, you can retarget people who have added to your cart, and you can retarget people that have initiated your checkout. If people already got there, you've paid so much money and you've invested so much time and effort to make someone go there and you're just gonna let them leave? I don't think so. So that's why you need to understand that someone, the levels of intent goes from minus to plus. So the deeper that anyone goes within your funnel, and by funnel I mean website, e-commerce store, can be, again, a survey, it can be someone who is just generating leads for a client, etc., has a, a lower level of intent to a highest level of intent. So it's really, really, really important to take this into consideration. And let me just go to the next page, to the next level. So again, number one, cold traffic. Number two, it's the warm traffic. And uh, number three, which is the, the hot the hot traffic, and now, for me, personally, guys, and I just want to make another pause. Existing is the most important list that you have and you should leverage. And if you're not do, uh, using it right now, I will strongly recommend you to do it today so you can get more money. The reason why is because someone that already purchased from you and... You, you did a really good job delivering their, your, your product, your service, your digital product, your download, your software, your tool, it doesn't matter. If you did a really good job fulfilling your client, 
they will be more willing to buy that someone that they don't have an idea who you are, right? So if you're following, you should leverage this stuff. So for the existing clients, I'll be definitely running offers. That I'll be giving them discounts before hot, warm, and cold. Why? Because if you start giving discounts at the really beginning, they just like they're just gonna pretend that you're just a simple brand and you're just giving out discounts just because you're trying to sell your products cheap. So since we're marketers, we really want to like explain to you guys that the most important part is to nurture your prospects. Since they are in cold traffic, they don't know you who they don't know who you are, they don't know where you're from. To okay, now I know them. I've been engaging with their Facebook page or their Instagram page or any other posts. And people who actually have landed to my website. So this is the reason why a lot of people fail because they're only focusing, again, in the 90% of people that are only new clients, prospecting, new clients, new clients. You have to break this down into different percentages, but really leveraging the existing clients because they can give you more revenue. They can give you testimonials than for you to use to capture people from warm and hot traffic and cold traffic to buy your product. Because if you have happy clients and you have really good customer testimonials, this is basically done. People who already have other people that have used the product that they want to buy and they be really believe in the product that you're selling, they will be more willing to buy than anybody else. So see how we actually, by using and implementing this four-step funnel system, you can really turn your business around. So again, if you're finding all this information valuable, please guys, this is applied to any type of business. Online business, physical business, doesn't matter. This can even be applied to a supermarket if they wanna run traffic to get more clients. It's the exact same principle. This won't change. So if you're finding this information valuable, guys, please, I strongly recommend you to go to SebastianGomezMentoring.com. I'm personally going to be taking the calls so you can talk to me if you really want to leverage these tools, all the knowledge that we have in order to grow your business. Again, if you're a brick and mortar business, if you're a physical business that don't have online presence, this is a must. And specifically in this moment when everything is hard and you need to really implement and have a strong social media presence, guys. So this is just like a really simple lesson that I just wanted to break down. And if you really don't understand it, I'll really recommend you guys to review this lesson. This is super, super, super important, guys. And all these lessons that I've given, I, and I still haven't launched the first step. And the reason why, it's because you really need to understand first the, the theory and really the most important things that no one else will teach you so you can understand how to run your first Facebook ad successfully. I don't want you to burn your money. We really want to help you guys really succeed because this is the moment in time that you can really take advantage of the situation, guys. So thank you so much. Um, I really hope you have an amazing evening. Thank you so much. Again, my name is Fabian Cordova and see you guys on the next traffic training.